Distinguished guests, esteemed colleagues, I am grateful for the opportunity to contribute with this video message to the Meridian Space Diplomacy Forum 2024 on advancing dialogue for the expanding constellation of global actors, an event that exemplifies the spirit of international cooperation which is necessary for new and future space exploration missions. Today, we stand at the beginning of a new era of space exploration and international cooperation and dialogue among stakeholders are essential to create an enabling environment without underestimating the complexity of the challenges ahead from technical barriers to geopolitical tensions. Space exploration is strategic for countries due to a multitude of reasons, such as scientific discovery, technological innovation, national security, economical opportunities, international prestige, and inspiring future generations. In the international arena, the strategic importance of space exploration is further evident in the increasing involvement of countries and companies, both public and private. This trend reflects the numerous commercial opportunity, including the potential for natural resource extraction. Moreover, the strategic relevance of these emerging space rays extend beyond mere economic gains, serving also as a catalyst for emerging countries to assert their influence and soft power. The European Space Agency, at the regional level, exemplifies this approach through its collaboration with various member states on common projects. By sharing infrastructures and resources, ESA member states optimize efficiency and cost effectiveness, ensuring the seamless execution of space missions while maximizing the utilization of available assets. We have other federative models at the regional level, such as the recent constitution of the Latin American and Caribbean Space Agency or the African Space Agency, which serve as an example of collaborative efforts in space exploration within their respective regions. Globally, the Artemis Accords, which outline principles of international cooperation in lunar exploration, exemplify diplomatic efforts to promote federative approaches in space exploration. At the heart of the Artemis Accords is the concept of the space diplomacy, which requires us to create partnership. It requires also an open dialogue, mutual respect and commitment. Through space diplomacy, we can unlock the full potential of space exploration from scientific discovery to technological innovation and economic development, as well as for promoting peace and stability on Earth. Italy actively supports initiatives to lay the groundwork for international discussion on the development of an international framework to enhance the peaceful use and sustainable use of space. With this spirit, Italy was one of the first countries to sign the Artemis Accords. Allow me to conclude by emphasizing Italy's and the Italian Space Agency appreciation for the forum like today's Space Diplomacy Forum. These platforms provide invaluable opportunity for debate, serving as the most effective means for a real cooperation and coordination through the traditional and contemporary principles of diplomacy. I extend my heartfelt gratitude to each and every one of you for your dedication, passion, and commitment to this important dialogue. I wish you all a fruitful forum. Thank you very much.